Welcome to Benjamin TV. Today I have a quick smoothie recipe and this one I've been doing a lot lately and it's delicious. First off the ingredients are <clears throat> spinach, protein, very good for you and you know blends well. You don't actually get too much flavor uh, of spinach into your smoothie. It's easily covered up. Watercress, very good for you, very, 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 very high in fiber and so many other nutrients. And you can get it in these like live culture or you know, it's still alive and uh, the enzymes and the energy that's gonna be in this is gonna be awesome. Peaches, mostly to cover up the flavors of these even though these aren't that bad. Um, and it gives it a little bit of a kick, like a tanginess that I like. Of course, for more added protein and calcium, I've got my raw milk. You can use almond milk if you want, it really doesn't matter. I uh, also got some yogurt. I just like the creaminess that this adds and I really don't put that much in there. And then ice. The reason you want ice in there, especially if you, oh, you wanna join me, little one? Okay, come on, come on. So the reason you wanna add ice in there is because when you have a blender like mine, like a Blendtec or Vitamix or something powerful, Sometimes it can tend to turn your uh, milkshakes like room temperature and I like it a little bit cold because when it's colder, it's more palatable, it's more delicious. Oh, I forgot as well, you always have to add one banana in there. Got a gram of protein, potassium, and guess what? It just makes it so sweet and smooth. If you're not a dairy fan, you can substitute the uh, milk and the yogurt for one and a half bananas and it'll be just as good. So here we go. What do you think, little one? What do you think? No. No. All right, so there you go. I've got the watercress spinach at the bottom. Very important. Uh, all the heavier things are weighing it down. I've got my peaches, got a banana, ice in there, uh, <clears throat> milk, and a little bit of yogurt. Remember, if you don't have a powerful blender like mine, just use less ingredients um, or cut up your things a little bit uh, <clears throat> more finely because it's totally doable with a more affordable blender. You just got, <laughs> what? what do you want? You just have to be conscious that your motor is not gonna be as powerful as mine. So let's go put it on, another one, okay? Smoothie. Hey, a link to this blender will be down below. <laughs> Little one, what's wrong? Tired. There we go. Once that's blended, get a nice big glass. Ooh wee. You know the thing I love about smoothies? It's a great way to get vegetables into your diet, uh, even if you're not a vegetable fan. I'm telling you the flavor of this. You'd never think there was vegetables in this. Okay, okay. This is such a great meal replacement or just a snack throughout the day to carry you over till dinner time. This is Benjamin TV. Make sure you go ahead and subscribe. Tell, uh, leave in the comments below what you want to see too. What kind of recipes for me? Come on, come on. Right. Juliana, say bye bye. Say bye bye. 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 All those flavors, you're just like stuck onto that pasta. Let's go ahead and plate this puppy. You can do it like this Italians. Oh, I messed it up. But it like that. But you know, we're American. Get all those flavors up on there. Mate, y'all. Come on. Come on, little one. In DQ to the max. Oh, do you have poo poo? Maybe that's what it is. Oh, I'd be crying if I had poo poo in my pants, too. Making it hot on daddy, little one. Once that's blended. Hi, right, right there, the camera. Say bye-bye. Can you say bye-bye? 
<laughs> That's oh, she meant that. She meant that. She meant that. Don't want to get the Juliana. <laughs>